I'm actually a chief plant operator at the uh, city of Barstow's wastewater treatment facilities. Serving a population of around uh, about 35,000. We were just having problems um, with scum issues, over aerating, uh, nitrification issues because of the huge temperature swings. Everybody thinks, oh, it's so hot. Well, in the mornings, um, during the winter time, you can get lows in the teens. Um, and then the summer times, it's the complete opposite, you know, 100 in teens. So uh, just that, you know, 100 degree swing between seasons. So operators are wasting um, erratically, you know, based on those, those feelings. So we went to DO control and we, we got some Hawk DO sensors in the very beginning and our minds were kind of blown away with just that, right? You know, uh, realized that we're under aerating and over aerating and kind of everything in between. And, and from that moment, um, just realized like technology can be your greatest ally, right? And, and it's picking up data. I mean, we're, we're there for such a small time uh, in the day, you know? I mean, it's an eight hour shift and, and there's so many things happening on holidays or high travel weekends and, and just realized, man, we're not doing half of a good enough job, you know, as what we could be doing. So we, uh, 2015, we installed uh, a couple more sensors. Um, we wanted to see what our ammonia was doing, how that nitrification process was happening, uh, installed uh, some nitrate probes, and, and we're watching where a denitrification facility as well. So just kind of, and, and every time we installed a probe, we went, wow, what else are we not doing, right? Um, and so the, the technology piece was just, um, I, I, was in, I was hooked from, from the beginning. We, we did nitrification first, and then once that was established and everything was running appropriately, then we went into denitrification, and then last, we went into SRT. We, we knew that we could pick up the phone and get that customer service. We, we you know, have years of, of trusting. Um, we knew the product could last uh, and take the, the Mojave Desert because it's, uh, it's pretty um, uh, aggressive. You know, we were looking for you know, energy efficiency on our blowers and just stability through treatment. Um, but our SVI dropped, our effluent suspended solids dropped, scum on the clarifiers and odors that come with that scum went away. I mean, it, it just overall um, helped the, the biological process. Um, total nitrogen numbers almost cut in half. I mean, um, yeah, so I mean, it was just kind of a a win-win, you know? Uh, and we were able to save, I think, about 12,000 kilowatt hours a month. So, and we're saving money. So, we're, we're, you know, it's, it's, a, it's a huge success on our end. I mean, we're, we're doing everything better and, and it's costing us less on the back end. So, yeah. it, it's good, it's real good.